Hi everyone, welcome back to How Logical. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to block someone on WeChat. If you want to get rid of someone and block them to view your profile or even send messages or any kind of a conversation to you on WeChat, keep watching the video till the end and don't forget to subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button. Press the notification bell icon so that you'll never miss another update from us. If you'd like to block someone on WeChat, start by tapping open your WeChat application and sign into your account if necessary. Go to the contacts icon in the bottom of the screen to find the contact that you'd like to block. Tap on the contact and once you end up in this page, tap on the three dots at the top right corner. You'll open up the settings menu. At the bottom of the screen, right above the report option, you'll be able to see the block option. Simply enable the button right next to the option and in the pop-up, tap on OK. When you block someone on WeChat, you will not receive any messages from them and you won't be able to see each other's moment updates. If you want to confirm that you'd like to block the person, tap on OK and you'll be able to block a particular contact on WeChat. If you'd like to unblock the contact back again, you'll need to go to the Me icon in the bottom right corner from your home screen and tap on Settings. Under Settings, tap on Privacy and you'll be able to see an option where it says Blocked List under Contacts tab. Tap it on and you'll be able to find the person that you've blocked recently into the block list. Tap on the profile of the person that you'd like to unblock and tap on the three dots at the top right. Toggle off the button right next to block and make sure to grey out the button in order to block the contact. Now the person has been removed from the blocked list or blacklist and you are back to being friends on WeChat. That is how you can easily block contacts if you no longer want to communicate with them or share any kind of information of yours. I hope you found the video to be helpful. If you did, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll soon be back with more tutorial episodes. Goodbye till then.